Well, nonetheless, uh, we are joined by the cruiserweight champion, the Brian Kendrick, here on commentary. Plenty to talk about for, for 205 Live in the season premiere tomorrow night. I'm excited. Here is a member of the cruiserweight division, and the man who will face Brian Kendrick on 205 Live for the cruiserweight championship. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first from Baltimore, Maryland, weighing 170 pounds, Rich Swan. And Rich Swan, Swan is set for action. It happens tomorrow night on the premiere of 205 Live, exclusively on the WWE Network at 10 Eastern, when the Brian Kendrick defends the Cruiserweight Championship against the vibrant Rich Swan, who won a triple threat match on Monday Night Raw last week to get this opportunity, and many are saying, Brian, that Rich Swan has your number. Are you, uh, are you suggesting something? Just saying he owns a couple of victories over you. Not when it mattered, Mr. Cole. His opponent from Air Scotland, weighing 170 pounds, Noah Dawg! It's hashtag 205 Live as we get set for the Cruiserweight premiere show tomorrow night. Noam Dara, someone you ran into. He was actually your tag team partner a few weeks ago in Dar's homeland of Scotland before you uh, well, uh, had some words with him and got a little physical after the matchup. Why did, why did Dar just show us his pinky? What's that all about? Look, he's a, he's, a, he's, a, he's a great kid, right? You know, he's got a lot of potential, and, and he could use this platform to be an inspiration like I am, but he's, he's more concerned about having his hair in the right place. His head is in the clouds, a lot like Rich Swan. Saying a guy like Rich Swan has his head in the clouds again. I mean, you go back to the fact that, you know, head in the clouds or not, Swan has proven that he knows how to beat you, Brian. Byron, he beat me once when I was having a, a tune-up match for TJ Perkins. The, the the loss was irrelevant. And the other match was completely Noam Dar's fault in a tag team contest. Byron, you realize you are speaking to the cruiserweight responsible for the success of the division and the show 205 Live. No, I'm, not, I'm not taking away anything from the success of, of, of the cruiserweight division or of you, Brian Kendrick, but I do question your moral compass a little bit. Look, I mean, you turn your back on TJ Perkins, you, you blame Noam Dar for his debut tag match loss, you're claiming Rich Swan has no threat to you? I mean, uh, Byron, listen up. My moral compass was thrown on the ground and stomped on seven years ago when I was fired for the mistakes I made, for the mistakes I owned up to. My wife was starving. When you were goofing around on Twitter, oh. are you going to tell me how to live my life, Byron? I'm a champion. You couldn't walk one mile in my shoes. You don't have the constitution. You're a quitter, Byron. And Noam Dar oh. taking out Rich Swan and Dar with the soccer style kick and, taking out the legs of Swan. And Brian, I, I mean no disrespect here, uh, but you seem a bit on edge tonight. Uh, perhaps knowing that you may only be champion for another uh, 24 hours as we see what happened to Rich Swan. I've, I've got a lot of responsibility on my shoulders, gentlemen. They created TBK Live specifically Cover. for me. Hook of the leg. Oh, and I thought he almost had him. This show wouldn't have been created without without my success, without my hard work. These cruiserweights now have a new platform, thanks to me. Yes, I'm under a lot of stress, gentlemen. Oh, that oh, stress will go away if you beat Mr. Swan tomorrow night. I personally think it's an honorable of you, Brian, to just to come out here and join us on commentary, to loan your expert expertise to the cruiserweight division. Well, thank you very much, Corey. I'm glad somebody here has a little sense. I, I gotta ask them, Brian. Again, I'm not trying to rile you up anymore, but again, what happens if? What happens if your debut, the debut of 205 Live, you leave that show with oh, the Cruiserweight Championship? What if? What if? Then, 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 then I go back to the drawing board. But, but Byron, the difference between you and me is I'm not a quitter. Okay? So, so if I lose this, then I have to get back, back to work. I have to keep working hard, like I've done every minute of every day since I was released seven years ago. Gentlemen, if Dar keeps this pace up, Rich Swan might go into tomorrow night less than 100%. Brian, I'm sure you'd appreciate that. Absolutely, and a win for Noam Dar would be even better because it gets into the head of Rich Swan, and I can use every ounce of edge I can get. So again, does that mean that you're concerned that Swan has your number? No, I'm not, I'm not, I'm, look, I'm not concerned, okay? Oh. 
those those matches meant nothing. He hasn't beaten me There's when Swan it counts. Him up. Oh, and a kick right to the back of the head. Look, Rich Swan is, has hit me as hard as, as I've ever been hit, okay? He's a great competitor. A little rolling. Thunder went for the splash and got caught by Dar. Here's the cover. Look at a knockoff Swan here and a kick out. Well, look, and, and Dar, for that matter, he's, he's got a backbone. He's no pushover either. So, Brian, let me ask you this question. If Rich Swan beats you tomorrow night fair and square, are you done with the excuses? No more excuses. Will you just admit that he was the better man? Michael, when have I, when have I ever given? I think it was a simple yes or no question. Roll up, by Swan. Roll up and a kick out of two. No, it was yeah. a loaded question. Oh man, what a kick! That could be Kendrick tomorrow night. Lights out for Dar Swan. Explosive win. Here is your winner, Rich Swan. It could end just like that, Brian. And just that easy. Rich Swan, we saw he put away Noam Dar. That could be you tomorrow night. Going to take another look at. Brian Kendrick's opponent tomorrow night, Rich Swan in action. This was early in the match. Well, he got caught by the soccer kick from Noam Dar. I'm sure Kendrick uh, took some notes from that. Yeah, Noam Dar is credit. He brought the fight in this matchup, but Rich Swan digging into the bag of tricks. And it could happen as quickly as this, Brian. This could be your fate tomorrow night on 205 Live. Rich, congratulations on your victory. Tomorrow night, the premiere of 205 Live, you will face the Brian Kendrick for the WWE Cruiserweight Championship. How does it feel to be 24 hours or so away from a potentially life-altering opportunity? Thank you, Corey, but may I? Is that... Is that... Is that the Brian Kendrick I spy in my eye? What you doing out here? You trying to play mind games? You trying to get in my head? No, I know what it is. You're doubting yourself because I already beat you twice. Twice! <laughs> <laughs> Two times. <laughs> but let me tell you something, Brian. Tomorrow night, the third time, is going to be that much sweeter. Because when I beat you on 205 Live, this time, I'll be coming home. The WWE Cruiserweight Champ. And, and, and why? Because you can't handle this! <laughs>